Welcome, in front of me is a Realme C35 and today I'll show you how you can enable the power saving mode. So to get started, simply pull down your notifications, expand it and look for the toggle which for me is located right over here, battery saver. And once you locate it, simply tap on it, select turn on and there we go. As you can see it turns on dark mode and there's a couple additional things happening in the background which uh, weren't really disclosed that well. So it will uh, limit background activities. Uh, so applications that you, for instance, have running in the background will be basically terminated almost immediately. Uh, additionally, things like Wi-Fi, if you have one enabled and mobile data will be turned off uh, when the device is in sleep mode. And this is sleep mode, just for people that don't know. So whenever you put your phone into sleep mode, it does disconnect from Wi-Fi and mobile to preserve battery. And because of that, you won't be getting any kind of notifications that would require any kind of internet connection. So that is something to really keep in mind. So there we go. That's basically the power saving mode. Now there is one little thing that I will add uh, for people that might be interested in alternatives. What I recommend doing is simply changing your brightness on the device. If you tend to run it at like max brightness, Dropping it just halfway will yield you several additional hours of battery life, which uh, most of the time is still more than what power saving mode will do. So that's why I recommend actually changing the the battery bright and the battery the display brightness uh, rather than actually turning on the power saving mode. The brightness does have more of an impact, and obviously it all you do is just reduce the brightness of your display, which doesn't really prevent you from using it and doesn't give you any kind of inconveniences if you don't lower it too much. But yeah, uh, going back to the actual power saving mode, once you're done with it, you can tap on the toggle once again to turn it off. So that being said, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.